Welcome. With the recent launch of the Intel 13th generation CPUs, I decided to upgrade my rig. My goal was to get much higher CPU performance for both lightly and highly threaded applications, while doing so at a reasonable cost and at a relatively low wattage. I paired the Core i5-13600K with the ASRock Steel Legend Z690 motherboard. Since this board has all the features I wanted and allows me to reuse the fast kit of DDR4 that I already owned. Prior to using the CPU, the motherboard was updated using the USB BIOS flashback feature. My goal in tuning the CPU is to increase the performance while using less power than stock settings. To achieve this, I tried various methods of lowering the voltage. The method that worked the best for me was changing voltages in the fully integrated voltage regulator or fiber menu in the BIOS. In the end, I ended up with the following settings. Now the CPU consumes a lot less power and is easily cooled by my 280mm all-in-one liquid cooler. I applied plus 200MHz to the all-core turbo, bringing it up to 5.3GHz, plus 300 to the 2-core turbo, bringing that up to 5.4GHz, and plus 300 to the efficiency cores, which bring those up to 4.2GHz. Here are the test system specs. The stock and overclock CPUs are paired with DDR4-4000 with tune timings. At stock, this CPU scores 24,112 points in Cinebench R23. This stock configuration drew a maximum of 199 watts for the CPU package power. With the CPU overclocked and undervolted, the score improves to 25,408 points, an improvement of over 5%. This is while drawing a maximum of 171 watts for the CPU package power. That is a reduction of 28 watts while improving the performance by over 5%. In Cinebench R23 single thread, the stock configuration scored 1985 points. With the undervolted overclock, which boosts to 5.4 gigahertz, the score increased to 2,110 points, an increase of over 6%. In Y-Cruncher, this CPU completed the 2.5 billion decimal calculation in 84.7 seconds. With the CPU overclocked, the calculation was completed in 83 seconds, a reduction of 2%. In SuperPi, the stock configuration completed the benchmark in 326 seconds. With the undervolted overclock, the benchmark completes in 310 seconds. That is a 5% reduction in time. In the end, making some adjustments to the 13600K in the ASRock Z690 Steel Legend BIOS has led to a better experience than using default settings. With my current settings, the 13600K runs faster than stock while using less power. In a separate video, I will go over the RAM overclock I have achieved on this 13600K using a 32GB kit of Crucial Ballistics DDR4 single rank Micron B die after many hours of memory tuning. Thanks for watching.